Action News Now Storm Tracker Weather. Coverage you can count on. Sports with us now, Court. It was one of those weekends. It was really tough to stay inside. So gorgeous outside. Yeah. A bit of a shift, though. Huge shift yeah. on the way. And we're starting to see some impacts ahead of that main event that's moving down the coast right now. Tonight, a chance for some showers. We are tracking some thunderstorm activity right now as well. Valley rain and thunderstorms possible Tuesday and Wednesday. Mountain rain and snow on the way over the next couple of days as well. The other big impact we're seeing out there this afternoon, gusty south winds. Here's a look at the sustained winds right now. 32 miles an hour out of the south in Red Bluff. 28 miles an hour right now for Chico. 24 miles an hour for Orville. So it's been very gusty, especially this afternoon. But take a look at this peak gust just over the last hour. Red Bluff, 46 miles an hour out of the south. Chico and Orville both seeing gusts of 37 miles an hour earlier on this afternoon. Redding, 32 mile an hour gust out of the south. So the winds gusting, that's been a big issue. Moving forward, what we're going to be seeing is a winter weather advisory going into effect at 5 a.m. tomorrow through 5 p.m. Tuesday for Trinity County, up to three inches of snow there. A more big, uh, much larger impact expected in the Shasta County Mountains and the western slopes of the Sierra. That goes into effect at 5 a.m. Tuesday morning through 11 a.m. on Wednesday, up to a foot of snow looking possible above 4,000 feet. Some isolated areas could be looking at 18 inches of snow on the way. And then we talked about the thunderstorms going on in the north end of the valley. A flood advisory has now been issued by the National Weather Service out of Sacramento. You can see this does include areas between Cottonwood and Redding moving up to the north and east, and that's the area where we are tracking those thunderstorms right now. So getting a look at what we've seen over the last hour and a half, thunderstorms developing in Shasta County, extending into northern Tehama County, and you can see the brunt of that is just off to the east of I-5, but we have been tracking some substantial hail there as well. Along I-5 between Anderson and Redding about an hour and a half ago, we did see some hail. Now we're seeing hail along 44 in Palisadro. Dangerous driving conditions in those areas right now. So if you could avoid using those roads at the moment, you're encouraged to do so. Now on to the main event that's dropping down from the north. This is going to arrive late tonight through early tomorrow. It's going to bring modest showers to the valley, more prominent snowfall to the mountains. Looks like snow levels down to 3,000 feet as we head through your Tuesday. Rain again, not exactly a huge rainmaker. We'll see maybe a half an inch for the northern end of the valley, maybe a quarter inch in the mid valley if that. Higher elevation, certainly seen the brunt of this heading through over the next couple of days. Snow levels mostly down to 3,000 feet through Tuesday afternoon, down to as low as 2,000 feet by early Wednesday, and then a chance for a few scattered mountain showers on Thursday. As far as what we're seeing for tomorrow, rain and snow in the forecast with mid 40s in the northern mountains for your afternoon. Rain and snow also likely for the Sierra and Cascades. Snow levels there mostly hovering between three to 4,000 feet, the heavier snow totals above 4,000 feet. Mid 40s expected for the foothills tomorrow. It's expected to be rain showers on the way, not expecting much in the way of snow for the foothills, maybe a little bit on Wednesday morning. And then low to mid 40s overnight in the valley with sustained winds to 20 miles an hour gusts, upwards of 40 miles an hour possible still this evening. Mid 50s tomorrow afternoon, rain and a chance for thunderstorms in your afternoon hours. Mid valley areas, mid 40s overnight. Tomorrow afternoon, back to the mid to high 50s. Rain likely, thunderstorms also possible heading through your Tuesday. Your Storm Tracker 7 day forecast where your weekend's always in view. Staying windy tomorrow, gusts up to 35 to 40 miles an hour and sustained winds to 20 miles an hour out of the south. We'll see mid 50s rain and thunderstorms possible both Tuesday and Wednesday before we dry out and warm up on Thursday with a chance for some lingering mountain showers dry on Friday and then another system moving through to our north Saturday and Sunday that will bring a slight chance for more showers on the way. We'll get a better idea of that when models converge a little bit better later on this week. Haley.